Everybody loves a good underdog story. Last week, heading into their by district match with Gorbin, not many people expected Eden to come away with a win. That could have been due to the fact that last season Gorman dominated the Bulldogs 68 to 20, or that they hadn't won a playoff game in over 25 years. But when they took the field on Friday night, none of that mattered. The Bulldogs won 74 to 62, and just like that, they find themselves taking on Jonesboro this Friday in Zephyr. With a win, it will be the first time the program has advanced past the second round since 1982. They're the underdogs again this week, but they're just fine with the flying under the radar. I felt like we've been a pretty good football team all year, and we really haven't. No one's really kind of talking about us. It's really kind of, you know, uh, been to our advantage a little bit that we kind of <laughs> get a little chip on our shoulders, we, you know, and um, we're a pretty good football team. And, uh, you know, I think we proved that last week. And, you know, I know we're picked to lose again this week by, uh, by, all the, by the experts. So uh, that's just that, that's a little fuel, fuel for us as well. Everyone's been telling us that it's crazy how we're making this happen. It's like it's a dream team cycle. So everyone's all shocked that, you know, Eden's is coming to this and Eden's all popping out now. I just think it's pretty good for our community. Honestly, I like being an underdog because it makes it makes me personally work harder to try to achieve and beat them. 